Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of SOAR, and today I wanted to take some time to tell you about an incredible novel and major motion picture. This story is just simply beautiful. The Boy Who Harnessed the Wind, written by William Kakwamba, is a true story about a boy named William who struggled through hard times. Yes, that's right. The author himself is the protagonist of this story. Through poverty, William's thirst for knowledge kept him going and drove him to succeed and to save his village. Though he could not afford proper schooling, he jumped at every opportunity he got to learn and he had quite a brilliant mind. This novel is about William who creates windmills from scrap parts in a junkyard. He was able to bring electricity to his family's home with his innovative and marvelous mind. He saves his entire village from famine when the maize crop does not turn out very good that year. This story is amazing, and that is why it is currently available as a major motion picture on many platforms such as Netflix. William came from a place where superstitions and magic were more prominently believed in than science and technology. He has six sisters and is the child of farmers, and receiving food for all of them was a struggle especially with the drought and the famine that year in his home, Malawi. How will William and his family survive? How will they obtain enough food? How will William create a windmill from scrap parts? Even when he has never heard of what a windmill is or what it does before. Read to find out and place yourself in this wonderful story full of passion, hope, education, learning, creation, creativity, struggle, friendship, perseverance, bravery, and more. This is a book and a movie that I would truly recommend. Thank you so much for listening to today's episode of SOAR. I hope you can leave a review or a recommendation for a book trailer for the next episode. And remember, try not to take the easy way out and by just watching the movie, and also try to read the book. Thank you. I implore you to SOAR.